Hey guys, it's Roth the Golem, and welcome back to South Park the Fractured Butthole. We're about to go through this door over here that says private in the back room of this restaurant where all of these cats are being held. And Tally came on and said that there's probably a boss fight coming up, so we're going to do a couple things. Well, we've already crafted and everything, but next we're going to save, because saving is always good right before a boss fight. Um, we've equipped a couple things, we've changed out my ultimate. Let's go in and let's see what we can make happen here. Of course there is. <laughs> uh oh. What have we stumbled upon? We're not cops, goddammit. Uh uh. Who are you calling a stupid bitch? Do I look like Ooh, sick burn, sick burn. These kids are cops? Exactly, we're freaking kids. Oh, never mind, he knows me. <laughs> oh, I love the fact that they know his background story. If they aren't cops, then we can shoot him. Along with this bitch too. Oh, shit. Y'all turning on me. Classy, this mean you're on our side? I shouldn't have went in the business with y'all Tony Soprano looking motherfuckers. And yet you did. Oh, Captain Diabetes. We're going to have to reverse Let's time, aren't we? Diabetes save you now. Uh-oh. Oh, Stan's dad? <laughs> um. Red wine drunk is the worst drunk there is. Is it? Really, though? Oh god, we're gonna fight Stan's dad now? Give me my fucking keys. You are in no condition to drive. Then die. Oh god. What is happening right now? Red wine drunk Randy. Oh my goodness. Alright, let's jump into the fray. You're being unreasonable, Mr. March. Let me call your wife. Leave Sharon out of this. Oh my god. Yep, yeah, we're gonna have to interrupt that right here and now. What? Yes, I can. I'm gonna kill out there. Oh, why did you have to be all the way back there, Fast Pass? Not fair. Not fair at all. There's literally nothing he can do. I can do nothing with him. All right, let's move him all the way up then. We'll end him right there. This, I don't. Uh, again, we can't go anywhere and do anything. Okay, here's it. Oh, wait, you know, let me. Uh, I'll move him down here. And then, swap places. I don't want to swap places with him just yet. Crap, let's end a turn there. Now you're gonna get I hate, the, I hate the, uh, this setup right now. This is so bad. Um, all right, we can at least hit him with this. Not much, but it's there at least. You cannot have your keys. All right, so wait, what does B do? Knock back and slow foes, gaining protection. All right, let's... uh. Let's hit him with this to give myself some armor. I feel like this is what we're gonna have to do. We're gonna have to have him tank, and we'll slow Randy down. Shit, shit, hang on, Sharon's texting me. Can't type. Why the fuck can't I type? Why my thumbs so big? Because they're your thumbs. It's just the way it is. Take a note. Tell my wife. Fuck off, cause I'm fighting. Poop emoji. Huh? Would Siri actually do that? Oh, oh my, up, oh, oh, Randy. Is it red wine rage? What's happening here? Nothing. Oh, he's got like so many turns all of a sudden. My keys. Uh -huh. Wow. The way you move. Don't encourage him. Oh boy. Why does he get so many attacks? This is not good. Thank God I can heal as well. Oh, and he got moved back. All right. This could potentially work to my advantage here. So, where's the one? Damage frozen grants fast pass invisibility. Strike a foe from range. Swap spots with an ally and heal them. That's what it is. Okay. Um, all right. Let's get Scott Malkinson back in there. Perfect. So now he can tank again. Captain Diabetes, get grateful for you. Coon, what can we do with you? Nothing again. All right. You know what? Well, damage and swap places with this. Even though I want uh, Captain Diabetes to tank, I can try to go up and tank a little bit. Uh, so we'll get me up here. We'll hit him. Nice. He's gonna lose, don't worry. Ah, but now Captain Diabetes can't do anything. 
I can charge, but I'm in the way. I can't attack. I can't use that either. Damn it. This is what I was worried about. All right. Um. Crap. Yeah, we'll just have to end his turn. Oh, man. She sounds pissed. Which <laughs> one of you assholes told Sharon I was here? Didn't tell oh, anyone okay. anything. I'm you pretty sure she doesn't even know that you're here. She just knows that you're not home. <laughs> heart, heart, XO, send. <laughs> well, at least he's still typing. So this gives him like three turns by like pounding down all the red wine. Only two turns. Ow. <laughs> all right. Uh, oh, God. Okay, there's my ultimate. All right, how, we got to be careful with this. We got to be really smart with what we're doing here. Um, let's see. Okay, Captain Diabetes, not Captain Speed Pass, Fast Pass, whatever your name is. Uh, let's get me some healing here first. Swap some salt places. Nice. Oh, that heal is so good. The Coon, what can you do now? All right, we're going to have you swap places again so Captain Diabetes can get in there and tank. You really need to stand up for hey, Mr. March. Yeah, no kidding. Um, I am going to unleash frosty, lightning-y hell upon him. Which, I don't know if it... I don't think it does much damage, but the, the status effects, I think, will be enough. Come on. Avatar powers activate. Shocked and chilled. Perfect. Okay. And then Captain Diabetes. Not knocked back. We want the uh, 36 in protection or 18 in slow. Uh, he needs the protection. So let's give him this first. <laughs> and we swap places. Okay. Wait, what? I think Stan's dad really wants to kill you, Scott. Ah, nice. All Sweet, so he just lost a turn because of that, it looks like. All right, fast pass. We should be able to hit him from here. <laughs> nice. Oh, man, like I bet on the wrong horse. Yeah, you did, Classy. Um, Coon, you're kind of useless, man. Like, seriously, at this moment, I don't want to swap spots with you because... Right now, I'm going to hit Stan's dad into Captain Diabetes and get the knockback combo. Yeah, Coon's kind of useless in this fight. Not going not gonna to lie. And this is going to be the uh, the thing that ends it. Could have done it without you guys, but I'm glad you were here to watch. <laughs> you you did, like, nothing. Smart man. Nobody drinks and drives on Captain Diabetes' watch. Awesome. So we got the Nether Talisman artifact, which gives us 60. And I'm trying to think of what that is, like what it looks like, but I can't tell. And we got Captain Diabetes character sheet and level four. Major slot, awesome. New artifact slot unlocked. So now, what's the difference between the artifacts I've been creating and a major artifact? Huh. Somebody trying to bring the Italians and Chinese crime families together and shit. Enough small talk. Where is Scrambles? <laughs> Scrambles? We so she has all this, like, really important information the police would want to know. In the meantime, we're just looking for a cat. Yeah. Then there's Cisco. He's just some low-class asshole who started working two months ago. He be talking all this shit about making money off the crime in the city because some big shot white boy be running all the drugs and all the hooks no, and shit, no. right? No, no. I just want to know about the cat. Okay. Uh-uh, but not me. I'm my own pimp, you know what I'm saying? It's like I got one investment in this world, and that's my pussy, and I ain't getting <laughs> no mortgage on that to some high-paying nigga talking about trying to make more money off crime and shit. Classy, classy, huh. I'm sorry, but what, what about the cat? Oh, that cat? Okay, yes, that's please. This little Asian freak named Yakibaba, some shit like that. He going around paying all these little sixth graders to take people's cats. That's fucked up. I think taking that uh, pussy and like taking mine, you know what I'm saying? That's like criminal shit. Where do the cats go? I can tell you, but I ain't saying shit until I know I'm safe. You understand? <laughs> These niggas ain't playing, and I need to know you gonna protect my ass. Eric Hartman. Uh oh. Do you have any idea what time it is? 
This is a school night. It's fine, Mom. Not now. We're seriously onto something. You kids all get home now, or I'm calling your parents. Aw, oh, sadness. Please don't tell my mom. And who is this stripper woman? <laughs> Just a stripper. Off of me protection. Well, she's not staying here. Fine, fast pass, take her to your house. Okay. Uh, wait, what? <laughs> his his uh, super abilities are so arbitrarily used. Good morning, South Park. Good morning, other people. South Park. A new vigilante took to the streets last night and yes. has apparently single-handedly taken down the Famboni crime wait, family. Wait, what? Here with more is a midget in a bikini. <laughs> Tom, I'm standing outside. I haven't seen the midget in a bikini in a long time. Where the vigilante declared war on crime in South Park. Security camera footage showed a young person farting in people's faces on their balls. It was just terrifying. So it was me. He came in and just started farting on people. <laughs> it was out of nowhere, man. <laughs> Maybe someone's finally standing up to what's wrong with this city. This new kid's a hero. The kid's a menace, if you ask me. How long before he or she kills an innocent person? How long uh, before Daredevil becomes the Punisher? What? Huh? Three seasons? Three seasons! Wait, what? He's called to the scene, found a treasure trove of illegal items... I haven't watched either one of those the uh, series, so... ...to a larger crime syndicate. This may be just the tip of the iceberg. Well, then, you're all welcome. Stuff, and there reports the vigilante possibly had a sidekick. There was thought to be a sidekick, Tom, but further investigation showed it was just some little twerp with diabetes. Oh, they so they did a role reversal on us. Minds now. Who is the farting vigilante? Huh. This is going to make us look bad. You fucked up. It wasn't our fault. What? This kid just came into the restaurant and started farting like there was no tomorrow. Some, they're connected to the cops? All you supposed to do is move the product. The Chinese and Russians do the rest. Everything has to be discreet and quiet, or people are going to learn the truth. That we put the product into people's drugs and alcohol in order to create more crime. Huh. So it is the cat urine. You just keep doing your part in getting the cheese out on the streets. Or maybe I'll start dealing directly with the Russians. Or the Chinese. Or... The sixth graders. <laughs> Do they too fear the sixth graders, or are they just no? They're just confused by it. Okay. I don't know if like even like the mafia feared the sixth graders. Oh man, what a great sleep. Yeah, we're great. That well in week. <sighs> so, you guys do anything interesting last night? Oh, no, no, no we were fine. Just watched some TV and went to bed. Yeah, yeah you know, kid stuff. Boring lives. Well then, I guess I'll just be seeing you guys tomorrow. <laughs> You've got a big day That's right. We all shall remain discreet. Get changed into your superhero costume and wait for a message from the king. <laughs> Which I honestly feel like would be just a joke from him. You're like, yeah, change into your superhero costume and then stay like that all day. Classic challenge completed. That was dumb. Oh, come here. Come here, you. Don't don't walk away. I'm gonna punch you in the head. Ah, oh, boy. All right. Well, let's see here. What do we have? Four missions. Uh, we've got shops and stuff. Oh, we're still collecting the uh, the art. Oh, what is uh, Master All Raisin Stripper Character Title? Uh, sheet titles. Okay, so that's just kind of like a progression mission. Um, and nothing. Oh, here we go. What do we have here? Find the suspect. Operation Just Cause. All right, I guess we're heading over to the police department, but. Uh, I'm actually going to end up doing that in the next episode. It's about to end anyway. I don't want to get wrapped up in something and have it, you know, get, you know, sidetracked or anything like that. So I might actually end up doing a little exploring as well. Now that I've got some new abilities, maybe I'll see if some more puzzles can be solved or not. But we'll find out in the next episode. Thank you all very much for watching. If you like what you've seen and heard, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And having said all that, I will see you all on the other side. Take care.